Hi everyone, in this video you are going to learn about the operation of Lopas RC network with the exponential input. We have seen different inputs in the previous videos. Now this video explains how a Lopas RC network behaves when we are having exponential input with an amplitude of like this V into e, 1 minus e power minus T by tau. Okay, T by tau here, this is the time constant of the generator where the signal is coming from okay but whereas the time constant of the circuit is different which is nothing but tau is equal to something like rc okay time constant of this signal is different and time constant of this circuit is different don't confuse the time constant of this signal is coming from the signal generator okay this signal will be generated from generator on signal generators are there okay from that generator it is having internally we are having a resistance and capacitance for that time constant is that that is tau okay our network time constant is different that is tau is equal to rc now if you are having this type of network and a constant input that is applying vn is the applied input voltage vn of t and va of t and it is the i of t current flowing through this resistance and capacitance are in this loop if you are writing this equation write kvl apply kvl around the loop around the loop then v i of t is equal to r into i of t plus v naught of t okay r into i of t plus v naught of t v naught of t is the voltage across capacitor that's why you can write it like this r into i of t is i of t is the current flowing through this network nothing but it flows through r and as well as c so i we can write it as c into dv by dt so here it is c into dv naught of t by dt plus v naught of t so what is the input voltage input signal is v into 1 minus e power minus t by tau this is that is the input signal that is equal to rc into dv naught of t by dt plus v naught of t so taking the laplace transform on both sides apply laplace transform on both sides then what happens v into 1 minus e power minus t by tau separate this then v becomes v by s minus v by s plus 1 by tau that is equal to rc into this is s into v naught of s plus simply v naught of s you can write it as capital v naught of s now if you take v common then 1 by tau by s into s plus 1 by tau that is equal to if you take v naught of s as common 1 plus rcs now v naught of s is equal to finally we need v naught of s v by rc tau into 1 by s into s plus 1 by tau into s plus 1 by rc again apply partial differential partial fractions then v by 1 by s minus 1 by 1 minus rc by tau into s plus 1 by tau plus 1 by tau by rc minus 1 into 
S plus 1 by RC. Okay, this is after the application of partial fractions like A by S plus B by S plus tau plus C by S plus 1 by RC. Okay, keeping S is equal to minus 1 by tau, S is equal to minus 1 by RC, something S is equal to 0, we will be having the solution for this one like this. So, apply, simply apply inverse Laplace transform, inverse Laplace transform, then V naught of T is equal to V into, see 1 by S is 1 minus 1 by 1 minus RC by tau into S plus 1 by tau. So, E power minus T by tau for this 1 by S plus T by 1 by tau divided by 1 minus RC by tau. This is constant, okay. We are not disturbing the constant RC by tau plus e power minus t by rc divided by tau by rc minus 1. Okay. So, simply you can also write it as let something a constant n is equal to rc by tau. Therefore, v naught of t is equal to v into just to write in a simple way that's it 1 minus e power minus t by tau by 1 minus n plus e power minus t by rc divided by 1 by n minus 1 because it is opposite case if t by tau is equal to x then v naught of t is equal to v into 1 minus e power minus x by 1 minus n plus n by 1 minus n e power minus x by n minus x by n. This is if n is not equal to 1. The same can also be written when n is equal to 1. 1 minus 1 plus x into e power minus x if n is equal to 1. See here when you are writing in the examinations if you are not aware of these two last equations just you can stop up to this point or even even if you do not want to substitute this n and everything you can also leave up to this part. Okay, Just further calculations if required you could do otherwise leave as it is no problem. No need to take another substitutions and exponential, uh, expanding the exponential equations. Okay. No problem. When we are having this type of tau and RC and here also in the denominator, when in problems, if you want to substitute directly, you can go. But in the problems, you may not have these N values and X values like that. Just to explain in a simple and better convenient way, we have assumed those n and x here to expand exponentially as well. Okay, so this is about the operation of low pass RC network when a exponential is applied the input with a notation like a v into 1 minus e power minus t by tau with a tau as time constant of the waveform. I think, but from where the wave, uh, input waveform is generated. Okay. Thank you.